Do you need a home lab to practice your hacking skills and don't know what to do? Then you're watching the right video. Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, I will walk you through on how to install OS Broken Move application. After watching this tutorial, you will be able to make your own home lab with vulnerable applications. For this, we're going to install OS Broken Web application on your host machine. So first of all, what's OS Broken Web application? It's a free Linux-based virtual machine that hosts a number of vulnerable web applications. Those applications have serious security issues to help you learn and practice hacking. You may ask yourself, why OS Broken Web application? The answer is that it provides you with a place to learn and practice web app hacking, web app penetration testing, and bug bounty hunting. As mentioned before, it has different web apps with different vulnerabilities, especially the OS Top 10. You may learn theoretical parts everywhere on the internet, but the important part is the practical part, in which the OS Broken Web Applications web application comes very handy. So it will help you uh, or provide you a safe place to practice what you have learned and also keeps you out of jail. So how to install it? The installation process is very easy and I will show you how. First of all, open your favorite web browser and type OS broken web application and then click on the first link which is from the sourceforge.net website so when you once you have opened the website just click on the download and it will download all the necessary files automatically for you so it may take some uh, seconds or some minutes depending on your internet connection because it's a big file it's almost uh, 1.8 gigabytes so be patient so i'm done with the download so now i have to extract it i'm going to open it with 7-zip and just extract all the files let me choose a new location downloads and the folder uh, os broken web application that which i have just created and hit ok uh, it will extract all the files that are zipped here into the location that does that i just specified and we are good to go so now all the files are being extracted here what you need to do is just uh, open your sorry let me just oracle come on uh, oracle oracle virtual box <coughs> so now i have just Kali linux installed on this so if you don't have uh, Oracle VirtualBox, it's a need, uh, a must for this. So you have to download it and install it. And if you don't know how, I have a tutorial on it on how to uh, download and install VirtualBox on your computer. I will put the link in the description below. You can check it out. So now you just need to click on the new and then the name for the virtual machine that you want. It is, uh, sorry, OWASP. BWAP for me, so you can name anything you want. So you can choose the folder where this will be. I'm gonna check it this PC and I want host it in the same folder as they call it Linux and just create a new folder for it. OS BWAP and I will just choose this destination for the installation of this file. I'm gonna choose Linux and we're gonna choose uh, Debian 64 for it. Yeah, and then click next. Uh, the allocated memory is okay for me. You can. It's okay for this machine because it doesn't need too much. Click next, and here be careful to choose this use an existing virtual hard disk file as we have just downloaded it. And so we are gonna add one here and from the OWASP Broken Web application, choose this one, the OWASP Broken Web Apps CL1 and hit open and just choose this one and click the choose and we can just create it right now. So now everything is good to go. You just need to start the machine. So now just start the machine. It will start the OWASP Broken Web application on your virtual box.
so now as you can see it's uh, all good uh, here it says as OS broken web application version 1.2 so the username and the password is also available here the username is read and the password is OS BWA there is also uh, a notification from the builders of OS broken web application that says this virtual machine has many serious security issues. We strongly recommend that you run it only on the host only or NAT network in the virtual machine settings. So it means that you shouldn't uh, run it on any other interfaces. It just should be on the host only or the NAT network in the virtual machine. So the point is that where you can check it out, you can just on VirtualBox, click on the settings and from here, in the network section choose the net for me it's already okay and that's good to go so let's just log in uh, root and the uh, password is OWASP BWA yep we are good to go we can just type uh, IP address to see our IP address which is okay yeah it is 10.0.2.15 and that's good to go so if you want to use this uh, broken OS broken web application uh, for your practice you have to access it from other machine like color Linux or Ubuntu uh, so let's do it so now I'm gonna just minimize this one and start the color Linux virtual machine So now the color Linux machine is up and the OS broken web application is also up. So let's check the IP address. The IP address is 10.0.2.15. So we can access this uh, machine uh, through its IP address on our color Linux machine. So let's just check this IP address if to see if they are in the same network. So, so the, the IP address of the Colonics machine is 10.0.2.4 so it means they are in the same network and we can access the OS broken web application so now let's open our browser and just type HTTP uh, 10.0.2 sorry dot 2.15 and that's it so let me just maximize the screen so now we have full access to the OS broken web application project here so as you can see there are different uh, uh, bro vulnerable uh, applications like OS web code OS PSP Java swing set intra interactive so there are many uh, uh, applications vulnerable applications also there are wordpress wordpress web applications that are uh, vulnerable to some specific uh, vulnerabilities so let's just check this one web good now it will open the open the os web good uh, application vulnerable application so we can just hit the start web good and now we have uh, a website that we can hack or practice uh, all the things that we have learned uh, before all the theoretical things that we have learned we can practice it here uh, on this web application so that was it for this video i hope you have enjoyed the video and if you do please don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit the like button hit the notification bell to be notified when i upload new video so have a nice time and see you in the next video.